From Daily Forex, this is Chris. I'm looking at the S&P 500 and the NASDAQ 100. You can see the S&P has rallied right to this little area here. That's going to be a lot of trouble. Um, I think, though, the buyers are really making a statement. So if we can break above the highs of the day, I think we'll make a run towards 2700. The 61.8% Fibonacci retracement is right in the neighborhood. We did close above the 50-day EMA, though. That's a good sign. So... Um, I think the, the momentum favors the buyers, but if we break back and close below 2600, that could be the turnaround. Over here in the NASDAQ 100, we're testing a long-term downtrend line. As you can see, it's been hit several times along the way. I think if we break above the top of the session for the day, we'll head to 7,000, and this might be the leader between the two, so pay attention to this one. If we were to break down below 6,500, that would be negative, um, but I don't see that as very likely to happen, at least not on Friday. Now, keep in mind, though, it is Friday, and you may get some um, position squaring heading into the weekend. People may not want to hold on to risk.